everybody, it's Ashley, and today I have my beauty empties for the month of March and April. April was a bit of a whirlwind for me, so I didn't film at the beginning for all my March stuff, so I just compiled the two months together, which probably is not a bad idea because there's not much here, because I don't do well at using up my products very fast. But I had my husband on vacation for a week to celebrate our 15th wedding anniversary, and also I had some dental work, some like intense cleanings and all four of my wisdom teeth out in April. So I didn't really wanna do much talking. <laughs> so I also didn't use a lot of products. It was kind of an off month for me. Uh, so there isn't, a mu isn't much here, but let's just get to it and I'll show you what I have. I have a couple of declutters. I have the Bath and Body Works Autumn Night uh, Moisture Cream here. It says it's Friday Night Lights, Cool Air, and Varsity Leather Jackets. This just went bad on me. These body creams, I need to start using up faster and focusing on these because they just don't last very long. Like, I don't know if you can tell. It's, it's a bad texture. The smell is still great, but I just, with that texture, no. Um, another declutter is this Clara's New York... 100% natural rosehip oil. Um, I didn't use this fast enough and it went rancid on me, which is kind of a bummer. The rest are all empties. I went through a 80 count of cotton cleanups. These are just from the Dollar Tree. They're not great. They kind of fall apart, but they're kind of soft on the eyes, which normally what I use them for is removing my eye makeup and, um, putting on my toner when I'm not using a spray toner. So they're fine, they're cheap. I finished up a Andalou Naturals 1000 Roses body lotion. This smelled amazing, but it was a very thin lotion. I mainly used it on my hands, and then to get the last little bit and finish it up, I used it on my body one time. Another lotion I used is the Bath & Body Works Moonlight Path. Travel size, that's completely used up. I went through a mini of the Colgate Clean Toothpaste along with a Colgate Total um, Floss. I haven't been using my water flosser since my wisdom teeth came out, so I've been not doing very good at flossing, but trying to use regular floss. I used a sample of the Glossier U Perfume. This smelled really good. I don't remember completely what it smells like. Let's see if there's any in there. Oh. It smells good, very floral, I think. <laughs> I finished up a Pond's Perfect Color Complexion Beauty Cream. This is crap, I hate it. I bought a bunch of these at Dollar Tree and I'm sad that I bought more than one. It made my face drier, I think. <laughs> It smelled great, it felt great when I first put it on, but then no moisture at all. So I have, I think at least one more of these to use, but I do not like that. I finished off a Lemon and Sage Energizing Body Lotion from Paul Mitchell. This is just one of those from like a hotel. This was smelled really good. This is an empty in my book. <laughs> It is the EOS Lip Balm in Peppermint. As you can see, there's still some in there, but it's completely flat. And with the amount of um, chapsticks and stuff I have in my collection, I'm not gonna dig this out. I've had it for a while, but to me, I'm calling it. I've got a Bath & Body Works hand soap in Cherry Vanilla Float. Juicy Cherry Shaved Coconut and Vanilla Cream. This smells so, 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 so good. Yes, absolutely. I hope they come out with that again because it smells so good. And then the last empties I have, like I said, it's not a lot. Um, and these are grody, so I apologize now. <laughs> and they took me forever to use. It is the Herbal Essences Rose Hips shampoo and conditioner. And these are the giant bottles and 
The conditioner was really hard to get out at the end. I kept adding water to it and pumping it into like a separate squeezy tube bottle and taking that into my shower just to try to get through more of it. But there's still like that much down in here and I'm done with it because there's this much down in that too and I'm not gonna dump, like take the cover off and dump it out. I'm blind when I'm in the shower because I don't have my glasses on. So doing stuff like that is just, it's not worth it to me. Um, that's another reason why I like to have like a clear bottle and a colored bottle or different cap colors because it's easier for me to tell which one's shampoo and which one's conditioner when I'm in the shower because again, if I don't have my glasses on, I can't see anything. <laughs> so that is it. That is all I have for empties. Um, I've got a few already starting, I think, for the month of May, but I'm working really hard on trying to start using my products more. I've got it, so I need to use it. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all have a great day. Bye.